David, a 2-2 draw here at Eastbourne, and as football cliches go, that was a, a game of two halves really, wasn't yeah. it? You're absolutely right, it was a game of two halves. Um, Eastbourne are a really good team. I think um, it's a well-run club, I think the management and their staff are trying to do it properly and, and doing it the right way, and I think it was a real challenge for us. Um, we managed to respond the second half to a poor um, poor performance perhaps in the first half. I don't think we can hide away from it, irrespective of what uh, happens next. We need to do better, we need to work harder, and we need to um, really be as effective as we were second half. And I think the boys did respond, did uh, some many good things. and. And perhaps when it went 2-2, maybe we, we took our foot slightly off the gas a little bit, which we just need to, to have a look at and analyse because we need to make sure that we are just going forwards and being uh, strong and competitive for the whole 1996, 98 minutes. You talk about that second half performance. From the stands, it looked a lot, lot better. Uh, and we, ultimately, we come down um, from two goals behind so that must, that must be a positive for the group as well, well. It, I think you're right absolutely right I think if we look back at the previous game we, we lost two late goals to grab a, a draw from the mouth of victory didn't we or whatever the phrase is and, and, and this time we've managed to come down come back from two down so there are many positives it's a good group it's a good group we, we need to make sure that we are producing and playing properly um, as much as, as we want to play and pass we need to get on the board and have some purpose in us for the for the full time and the beauty of this league and, and, and football as a whole is that the games come thick and fast and that is the same now in two days time we go again back at home against Bath City what are your thoughts going into that one with the quick turnaround and what yeah. you're hoping from in that game yeah well we need to be hopefully uh, being positive and strong and go forward I think the fans were fantastic today um, hopefully they can they can come again on, on Monday and, and really support us as they always do. But we need to be make sure we're positive and strong and go from there. I know how much a big challenge it's going to be on Monday. It's we, I think we've actually talking about the games. I think I think to a degree we, we've missed the midweek games. Uh, it, so often you start with a real flurry of games and, and and you bounce from performance to performance. We've had gaps in between the weeks, which has been an interest in psychology. It's. Uh, it's been good on one hand, you get some recovery in, you get some work on the on the training ground, but um, we also miss the games and really want to be involved. So it's a, a huge game for us on Monday, we look forward to it. And just finally, uh, go into the, the season as you always do with the glass half full mentality, we're still undefeated. <laughs> yeah, that's absolutely right. We um, we have to look positively at it, we, we try very hard to. We've got to make sure that we're not naive and we, we're looking at uh, ways to get better and, and really analysing what we're doing but we're, we're certainly positive and going forward and, and and I'm very positive about the club the fans the club the, the community the, the, the players the, the, all the staff here you guys uh, 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 included that, that are looking to try and do the best they can so we just need to make sure that we pull that together as much as we can and make sure that we are working to the best of our ability. David thanks very much for your time. Thank you for your time.